something is in the air. I'm not quite sure what it is just yet, but something's in the air. The energy is feeling weird. And that's the best I can describe it. Weird. Like something is about to happen. Spirit team, tell me more. What is the message here? What's going on with this energy? Okay, page of wands. Okay, somebody's exploring communication. Ten of pentacles. Like this is life part. This is giving life partner energy. Somebody here wants to come forward and offer you a new emotional beginning. What? Mm-hmm. This is somebody that betrayed you. This is somebody that I feel like walked away from you um, in a very sneaky manner, okay? So they could have ghosted you. There's something here surrounding this person, like almost like rudely interrupted there, but this person has been doing a lot of reflection. So I feel like this person, yeah, just walked away in a very sneaky manner. That's kind of what's coming up. What's going on here? Ten of Cups, but this person's realizing that they actually sabotage themselves here because you are the happy ending. Like they can see all that happiness with you and now they're kind of looking back on it thinking, oh my God, like I had it all and I sabotaged it. So yeah, now that intuition's like, you know, saying to them, oh my God, like what did you do? Why did you do that? Like you are this person's happiness, but let me tell you this one thing. This person is a fucking energy leech. Like, I feel drained doing this message. Like, I genuinely feel drained doing this because this person is such an energy, like, leech, literally. The Hermit, the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, see, this, during this separation, like, I feel like this person has really been reflecting on this connection. Um, This person may have been portraying that they're doing well, that they're independent, they're living the best single life, whatever. But actually... They keep looking back at what they could have had with you. I don't understand this message though. I don't really know. Queen of Cups. You really cared about this person. And I feel like this person thought the grass was greener. I keep hearing like this person thought the grass was greener. So there could have been a third party involved here in this connection. And the thing is, right? Wow. Like you cared so much about this person. You showed this person so much love. Like you did not deserve the treatment that this person put you through. But the, the truth of the matter is, right, this person never felt like they were enough for you, okay? And it's almost like they wanted to leave before you could leave them. That's kind of what's coming to mind here. Two of Cups. But in reality, they, like, they want to be with you, but it's like they don't know how to be. I, I oh, what? Ace of Wands, yeah, listen. So they want to come through and offer you that new passionate beginning, this connection that you've been seeking this whole time. But there is that element of them not feeling good enough. Yeah, and that's why they betrayed and sabotaged this connection previously. This person, like I honestly, ugh, this reading, I, I, oh my God, what the ace of pentacles. This person wants to come through and offer you like this stable new beginning, right? But they're conflicted. The worry that there's going to be a fight, there's going to be an argument, there's going to be conflict, five, 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 like change. This person really played the, like, played you, okay, previously. So, yeah, so now they're afraid that when they come in with this offer, you're not going to have it. Like, you're not going to, three, three, three on timer, that you're not going to have it. But this person is so determined, so passionate here. I feel like they, they do know that you are the key to their happiness, I do feel this person has been doing a little bit of work on themselves though, like that reflection took place for them to understand what's going on. Temperance, literally, I feel like this person has really been doing the healing and you've been very patient with this person. So I feel like, you know, the two of you may have been in separation for quite some time. Ultimately though, listen, this person, this person's coming in to express how they feel about you, okay? With the six of wands on the bottom of the deck, like, they're hoping it's going to be successful, but ultimately it's down to you. Like if you want to let this person in, let them in. However, just remember what they put you through and ask yourself, realistically, can you trust this person? But also, is this person coming back in, in the right energy for you to even consider it? Like do not allow them to treat you in the same manner again, because you know you deserve better. You know you do. Okay. So make sure you, you literally stick to your boundaries like make sure that you're honest and authentic and you stay true to yourself no matter what